stressful day for you in the chair. Yeah. Um, so you were not in uh, Alex's chair for the first game. Yeah. He didn't win. Yes. You came in the second game and the third, he won. Yeah. Tell us from your perspective as a coach, what uh, strategy you went into it, what tactical advice was yeah. supposed to be in place, yeah. and did it go to plan? And if it didn't go to plan, what changed? Yeah. Uh, yes, obviously, uh, uh, yes, a busy day for me, like four singles matches, and 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 uh, yeah, I was just watching Alex the first set with one eye, and uh, it seemed like he's got a good tactics, but then obviously he lost the focus and the discipline for for a few minutes, and then the set was gone. But, yeah, because obviously, like Tommy is an experienced player. In the second set, we needed to be really mentally disciplined and uh, and disciplined with the game. At the same time, of course, like physically really solid uh, to keep up the plan. Uh, that's what we did. The, uh, we are playing with a slow shuttle, so we had a certain uh, plan uh, where we went to hurt like Tommy, and uh, that worked uh, like pretty well because we were very disciplined. So uh, very happy with the solid game and with the mental and physical discipline that we showed. Yeah, so I think our, our cameras, we caught a lot of the end of the third set as well, where he lost, well, I believe, four points on, on match point time. Yeah. Because again, losing just that little bit of discipline, yeah. long rallies, slow shuttles, Yeah. that made a huge impact. Uh, you know, uh, it's not uh, hard uh, to lose the focus here because obviously it's very physical when you get uh, like tired. Yep. You want to finish uh, the rallies a bit uh, more quick yep. and when you want to finish more quick then uh, your opponent is using it or you make a, a few more like unforced errors. So the goal is to stay, as I said, really disciplined with the mentality and with the physicality and be, be, be patient with the game style and uh, hurt exactly in the situations that you want to create and not in every small situation. Yep. So for tomorrow's match, how is he preparing for, for tomorrow's match? Obviously, first of all, it was a tough match, so uh, we need to recover. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and, and uh, in general, I believe that the conditions in the hall that fit to Alex's game like pretty well. But again, we play against a very physical player tomorrow. So uh, yes, again, we need to be very uh, patient. patient and disciplined uh, and mentally strong. To, to take the chances on the right times. Okay. I have to ask about Olympic qualification, obviously being a French team uh, in Paris as well. Are you guys keeping a little eye, a little window on potential chances or completely not focused at all and focus on the long term? Uh, you know, uh, there are uh, different focuses. Uh, uh, for the boys, uh, we always focus on the development, so uh, Paris or, or Los Angeles, we are always focused on the development. So we believe that if we develop, uh, we will qualify. Like obviously, we will probably not qualify to like Paris because Popovs uh, are doing a very good job and credits to him, they have they have done and they are doing a very good qualification. Mm -hmm. uh, so, yeah, that's very good for the French badminton and uh, yeah, we are happy for that. And uh, for the girls, it's all about the performance and uh, uh, yeah, they have a close competition with each other as well. Very close. Uh, yeah, <laughs> and, and uh, so uh, we uh, just uh, try to manage that the best like possible way, but for them it's more about the performance uh, than about the development at this moment. Okay. One last one. Um, I saw Alex at the Hilo Open towards the end of last year. So it's yeah. about three months, three and a half months. He looks even more conditioned, even bigger at this point. Yeah. What percentage of strength and conditioning in terms of ratio? Is it like 50-50 on core technical work 50%, SNC 50%? It's, it's, it's very difficult to say. Like obviously, we uh, uh, we have a very strong like a physical coaching team, and uh, we are working very closely together. And uh, like obviously, in men's singles, the physicality is uh, is is crucial. 
So we are focused on that, but uh, it goes together with badminton. So the yeah, the physicality like outside the court goes together with uh, with the on court physicality. So it's very connected, and we are working very close with uh, the physical like, coaching team and. Uh, uh, we are getting better, but still the, the competition is very high, uh, like in the world, in the highest level. So, 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 uh, we are on the way. Yeah, I yes. Speaking to players, a lot of players are quite wary of Alex now. They're, they're, Alex is hitting their radar quite quickly now because of how physical he is. Uh, yeah. and he has a wide range of skills, which every time. Even I see it, I can see a difference, you know, so obviously the elite guys will actually be able to notice. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I think he's making great progress. And yeah. like I said last time around, the French team on a whole is, is going up. Yeah. So it's good to, good to see. Yeah, we are moving also as a team, you know, so it's yeah. our now, it's Alex. Uh, Everyone's uh, pushing each other. Uh, yes, everyone is pushing each other and even with Christo and Tommy, that's a very good competition. So I believe that French badminton is in a privileged uh, situation where we have to compete against the best in the world, but also we have to compete against each other in France, which is a very good motivation, I believe, for uh, for each of the boys. And uh, yeah, we coaches, we need to support that and uh, and then work smart uh, in the long term development, also not to be overwhelmed for the short uh, term results. Yeah. No, oh, that's absolutely amazing. Uh, yeah. Kesti, really appreciate the time you've always given us. Um, we hope to see you many more times this week. Thank and you. That's, and that's the goal. No, thank you so much. Yes, yes thank you. Appreciate Bye. that. Yeah, thank you.